so I'm really just here to welcome you. Um, so welcome to Sanford, and welcome to the Women in Data Science uh, Conference. I have to say I am thrilled to be in a room full of women at a technical conference. It, you know, it feels different. It is different. And it's great. For once, there's just no question I'm in the right room. Okay? I didn't go into the wrong room by accident. So it's rare. It's too rare. It's something to celebrate. I'm thrilled you're planning the next conference already. And the goals of the conference are, as you know, to inspire and educate data scientists regardless of gender, but also to support women in the field. And I just thought I'd give you my own personal three reasons why this is really, really important. So the first one, and this is echoing something Margot said, but in a slightly different way, we want everyone to be able to pursue the intellectual path that they're excited about, right? Each of you is a role model for young women and young men, but especially young women, who have an interest in the field of data science. And as they see you, and they see you being successful and happy and excited about what you're doing, they can start to see themselves. As you support each other to be successful, you chart a path for the young women of the future. And through events like this, you develop networks that will become a source of support, both for each other and for the next generation. Now, there's a reason we need young women and young men to be contributing to this field. Solutions to the challenges of our future increasingly link back to data and data science. If there is a field that will define the next decades, it is yours. We can't afford to live in a society that in subtle and maybe some not so subtle ways actually discourages half the population from careers in this exciting field. But finally, and, and always important to emphasize, when there are hard problems to be solved, everyone in this room brings an important and a unique and a different and a diverse point of view to the table. There is a lot of talk right now about the importance of diversity, especially in Silicon Valley. But what often gets left out is why it is important. And I tell you, I feel this one particularly because our students are a bit confused sometimes. It's moving back into a, a check the box kind of mentality, and that is really bad. Diversity is not about checking a box. Our students, our di very diverse students here at Stanford are not here because we were checking boxes. Diverse teams, diverse groups, diverse approaches to problem solving are better, period. When there is a difficult challenge to address, and our world is full of difficult challenges, we need a diversity of thought, a diversity of approaches, a diversity of styles to get to the solutions. And that's why we need diverse teams. Now, let's acknowledge, sometimes diverse teams can be more difficult to manage. It's really great to manage a team where everyone agrees with you, but you will not get to the right answer. When you have a team where people don't agree, respectfully don't agree, and bring different approaches, you have a much better chance of success. And working in teams where people come from the same background and have the same approach, in my view, is a path to failure. And unfortunately, I have a little experience watching it go to failure. So I, this one means a lot to me. So, 
So incur I encourage you to celebrate, to enjoy this conference, understand your role, and accept your role in inspiring the next generation to follow their passion and make contributions to this important field, especially young women. And for each of you, cherish your roles as the disruptors, as the outsiders, as the leaders, as the team members, and help keep the reason that we continue to need to push for diversity front and center. So have a great conference. <laughs>